Hey everyone, welcome to Stratelling Studios. I'm Jeff Castanon. and welcome to another No Pause video reaction and analysis. Today we have one from Lexington Lab Band. They are doing the Allman Brothers song, Jessica. And thank you, Scott from Texas. This was your request. Let's get right into this. Here we go. I love those guitars.
He relies heavily on repeating phrases to pull you in. Nicely done, gents. Nicely done. Some of the things that come to mind as I watch this, first of all, that drummer is like a freight train on tracks, man. Just so solid, so driving. Oh, kudos. Very, very well done. I even really like the section that he had his fills and stuff like that. Very, very nicely done. Um, I can tell he's a seasoned drummer. Um, Really cool. I really, really enjoy those dual guitar uh, licks there, which is kind of a signature signature thing for the Allman Brothers. Um, I am not extremely familiar with the song, even though I've heard it before. I don't know if all of the sections where there were solos were note for note matching the original. Um, doesn't matter either way. Uh, it doesn't matter to me if they if they do that or they don't. Um, but uh, I, I did did find those uh, sections really interesting, and uh, when the piano player took his solo, it was, it was a really really nice solo. Um, the color in it, the interest in it, to the flavor of it, and same thing with the guitar player when when he went into his solo too. And the interesting thing that I found about the guitar player, as I mentioned during the video, was that he relies pretty heavily on patterns to kind of usher you in and keep you on the hook. And that's a very nice thing to do uh, as opposed to, you know, um, some players will just do a lot of lines that don't repeat. And, and that's fine too, because it's just kind of like, it depends on, on what your intent is. But the intent of repeating phrases like that and just varying them up a little bit is to kind of help the, the, the listener to kind of get on your back and to go with you you know, and to help them to try to anticipate, anticipate what you were doing. And there's a combination that I find most interesting uh, during soloing or improvisation, which is the balance between anticipation and doing something new of interest. And there's this constant thing that a great improviser will do where it kind of like sets the, the 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 musician will set down some breadcrumbs so that the listener can follow and anticipate where they're going and then they anticipate it and you go there and there's a satisfying feeling to it but you can't have that 100 percent because it gets boring so there's a little bit of also having little twists and turn within that so that the listener goes, oh, that's where you're going. Well, okay, well, I'm going to go with you. So um, really cool. And I did notice that in the guitar players playing that um, there was a lot of these patterns, you know, a lot of pentatonic stuff going on, these these patterns. Um, like I said, I don't know if that was the original solo 
um, or if he improvised that. But um, regardless, uh, the point is still made either way. Uh, so that was really that was really fun. If ever there was a feel good song, this this is it, man. I mean, this really is a great great feel good song. As I'm listening to it on a hot day here out in the desert where I live, and the high today is going to be 111 degrees. Um, I, I don't mind. I don't mind the heat. I I, I actually um, I relate the heat to fun and vacations and stuff like that. So um, I keep the house very cool. So my electric bill is extremely high, but um, I still get a really good feeling, you know, um, when it's it's warm like that. Uh, but you know, this kind of reminds me. You know, we just had Fourth of July, and it, it reminds me of like music that's blowing in the back as you have a cookout with your friends and family. So, ah, very good. Scott from Texas. It's probably hot out there in Texas too, isn't it, Scott? Great, great track. Lexington Lab Band, Almond Brothers song, Jessica. Very cool. I'll put information in the description, so keep an eye out for that. Come back for more cool stuff. See you next time. Bye-bye. Hey, I just wanted to let you all know that the Stratelli Studio Shop is up and running. This is the artwork for the various designs that I have on the products. Basically, it's studios A through F. These are the graphics that I showed at the beginning of each video. And you can get these graphics on a variety of products. As you see here on the website, you have 10 products that are customizable. You can actually change the location or the size of the graphic on the product. I hope you come check it out.